Solar panels are spreading across Yemen's Sana'a district. For farmers who rely on water pumps to survive, they are a lifeline. Solar energy has covered two-thirds of our water needs, and we now can save on fuel, which we are using for only one third, as we are relying on the solar panels now. The panels are a sustainable alternative for traditional pumps, which are expensive to run. But as always, there's a knock-on effect. Yemen has a very dry climate, and an escalating water crisis is alarming environmental officials. They say solar pumps increase the usage of groundwater in the water-poor country. The amount of groundwater extracted annually is about three and a half billion cubic meters per year, of which 90 percent is for agricultural use and 10 percent is for domestic and industrial use. According to the UN, more than 80 percent of Yemenis rely on humanitarian aid, and more than half of the population does not have access to clean water. While solar-powered irrigation makes life a little easier for Yemeni farmers, it risks depleting the last vital resources the country needs to survive. Sena Saylan, TRT World.